Hello, we're doing something a little bit different today. I'm doing a bit of a CC shopping um, video. I don't usually do stuff like that, but I figured, you know, I kind of want to. If you hear this music in the background, it is this. Lo-Fi Geek on YouTube is absolutely wonderful. Um, they do live music stuff. They also have videos of it, you know, things like that. Very nice. Very nice. Anyway. Oh my god! <laughs> like, okay. <clears throat> I opened these up previously, but I didn't scroll down to see what was on here. And this is definitely, um, not something I expected. Wow. I can make my satyr characters. So, the whole idea of doing this was, um, I didn't think about it until recently, but I play Dungeons and Dragons, okay? I play Dungeons and Dragons, and... I just realized last night, wait, I could totally, like, make my characters on <clears throat> Sims 4, and I didn't even think about it here, this is, let me turn this down just a tad, but yeah, I didn't even think about it, and then I thought, you know, maybe I'll, I'll see what sort of, like, fantasy CC is out and about, and... You know. I got this. <laughs> yeah, everyone's out here making stuff for vampires and werewolves and mermaids, which you don't get me wrong, are just awesome. As easy to... Ooh. Nice. Oh, that's cool. <gasps> Whoa. They really do, wow. How does this... This is a paint, I don't know if it placed on shorts. Ah. Natalia Auditor has some real good shit, apparently. So, um, if you like fantasy stuff, go s support them on Patreon. I can't right now, but... Man, that's sick. I also did a CC shopping stream last night. Um, <clears throat> but I figured, okay, um, I'm sorry, okay. But I figured, okay, well, I will do a CC shopping video, and then I'll make a video of me making my characters, my Dungeons and Dragons characters on Sims 4. Um, I thought that was a great idea, so. Ooh, Fire Genasi! <gasps> Oh my god. Oh my god. What? The yes. I don't have a fire genasi, but I might make one. The ones I'm going to really make are an elf, a Kalistar, and a dwarf. Um I got some elf ears and stuff yesterday, last night, whatever. 
on the 24th. <laughs> Cedrael. <laughs> Here we go, gotta wait 15 seconds. All right, there we go. Let me sign in real quick. Okay, oh, that's cool. Mm, I don't think I'd use it though. All right, back over here. What else? I, ooh. So, Stonehenge. <laughs> oh, I do like that. Made for men, but could be worn by women. Well, duh. file share yeah I'm mostly just gonna ooh make three of my characters maybe a fourth one because there is an a uh, warlock with an undead patron I kind of want to make too um, But, first of all, I love Dungeons and Dragons, and I wish I had <laughs> a, uh, a D and D Beyond membership so I could have five million characters again. <laughs> yes, Natalia Auditor. Yep. Nice, nice, nice. Ooh. There's a bunch of... We had an update on two clicks I made a long time ago and made two more versions. They don't conflict with eyelashes anymore. Cool. Version 1. Version 2. Version 3. Version 4. Oh, that's just head down. I love it. I love it all. Oh, that's right. Those are a thing. I didn't get those. Ooh. But no, that's not what I'm looking for. I'm going to put what I have so far in my mods folder, and I will be with you shortly. Oh, okay. I don't know this is about the friend goal of type tiny people. My most sparkly are the worldly insects. characters are like adults <laughs> I don't have any child characters I feel like it'd be weird for me a 25 year old woman to play a child character so mm, 
No. I've seen that one. I could use this for my sea elf. Oh yes. Alien sims, not an alien sim. An elf sim. That's sick. I love for all sims. <laughs> Cause I have to like manually make my elf. There is no like elf option in the occult section. So although I might yes they do. By the way, and in case you followed me and were a racist piece of shit, you can leave me. You can go away. Um anywho I might keep this website. Siren ears. Um, you know, sure. You know what? Maybe these could be my elf ears rather than typical elf ears. That'd be fun. Be a little different. Maybe some texture overlap. Well, that's fine. No ear preset, but ooh. Um, all ages. Merged all ages piercings. Is that one pierced? Yes. <clears throat> Ooh, that's kind of cool. Um, but I just want the no ear presets uh, these are below the things I see oh all right oh I might use that for a character but that's beside the point where's the download button there it is okay your creations ready to download then give it to me I also saw this. I know this is kind of like off the simplicia simplicity, I think is how it's. This looks lovely. I really like this. I could put that on a character. Anywho, let me download this. Okay. Um. That's cool, but that's not what I'm looking for. No. Okay. Let's go over to here then. As you can see, I have a bunch of other tabs open. <laughs> <clears throat> I mean, I don't even want like gameplay. I just want pictures. <laughs> like honestly, not even joking. Although, I kind of want that, just because I can. That's right, I've seen this. This is adorable. Do you want a poodle that looks like a dragon? 
called hybrid unlocker. <gasps> oh, yes. still be genetically related that is amazing time lords yes let that out unique mod for a time lord Ooh, that's kind of cool witchcraft career i'm downloading it <laughs> Blacksmith? That's sick! Hold on now! Dungeons and Dragons races as trades! Yes! That's exactly what I want! I am... <laughs> Expanded mermaids? That's cool. Oh, this adds new occult. Hold on. Let me let me read this. Okay. So yes, it adds two new occults, so I'm absolutely downloading this. Are you kidding me? I have Island Living. I have a, quite a few of the expansion packs, actually. The ones I currently don't have are some of the kits, the high school years, and the werewolves. So, let me download all these. <laughs> Here's the one I was mainly looking for. <laughs> so, I also have more traits in Creatism, so I can have this along with some other traits I want. So, oh, my back. Let's see. Who looks like enough to behave like one? This is the mod for you. Yes, indeed. We choose for two or half races. Based on Dungeons and Dragons lore from 5th edition. That's what I play. She's an aquatic elf. Or a sea elf. Uncomfortable when not in water. God, that's so sick. I'm so glad this is a thing because I, I need it. I need it and I'm so glad it exists. <laughs> okay, over here. Ooh, that's nice. Um. I don't know about this one. Ooh, that's nice though. I kind of like that one. <laughs> Ooh. Uh. <gasps> oh my god, the clothes. The dress. Oh my God. Let's uh let's go download a bunch of shit. Yeah, if I had uh, a VIP, I could download all of this in one go. Stick it all in a, a basket and download that zip file. But unfortunately, I don't right now. Look at this. This is lovely. Does it come in green? Cause I kind of. Whole set. Give me the whole set. Oh my god. Yep, so fucking lootly. What's this? Hold on. Let me read the description. Cuts pants. Youth and adults. Earth colors and one dark gray. Requires realm of magic. I have realm of magic. That's no big deal. <laughs> Not a problem. 
I have that one. All right, this dress is lovely. But also, these can work on female bodies, and this is more like what at least my uh, Kalistar wears. I haven't really figured out what my CL wears, though. Oh, fancy. What else is there? What else is Skyrim known as the Bossmer? To move to see in search of a life of fame, right? <laughs> Maybe. And I'm not even joking, all this is just gonna be her pictures. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Um, although I might play as uh, some of them. But it's all mainly just, you know, pictures and. Look, I made my Sims 4 character, my D&D &D character in Sims 4. That's all this is. All this is for. But it's nice because, yeah, it's not the best way to get images for, you know, your characters and stuff. But if you can't afford commissions and you have sims 4 this is probably the best way you're gonna get stuff marks of a high elf snow elf skin um i mean that's nice but my elf is gonna have like blue skin well, taking a closer look at this skin, it doesn't really have much to do with elves. I assume the creator of the mod decided that it looked like the skin of a snow elf and they named it like that. Well, it stays on the list anyway. <laughs> There's some elf ears on your sims and put the skin on and hey, they'll resemble an elf, yeah? I mean, yeah. <laughs> elf tattoos, no. That's Christmas elves. Yes. Those are nice. <laughs> I mean, Christmas of the chairs. <laughs> it is close to the holidays. It is November twenty fifth. Oh my god, cute. Smell fears and earrings, nice. And they wear <laughs> the amount of earrings to show them off. Well, but he the elf. <laughs> Ooh. One eccentric high elf. <laughs> Or you could turn free real estate on. Anyway, let me go download the other stuff real quick. Leia Lilith is one of my favorite hair creators on Sims 4. And this is exactly something I'd be looking for just in general. Like, my Kalashtar has like platinum blonde hair like that. But also, there's like a seafoam green color that I could use for my um, sea elf if I wanted to. Like, it's pretty, it's pretty, pretty great. Anywho, let's download. Okay, well, I could easily do this for hours and hours. I will end this here because I'm just going to end up getting a whole bunch of stuff I do not need. Um... And I'll probably end up getting more after I get off here. So thank you so much for watching and hanging out with me. 
If you enjoyed, hit the like button. If you'd like to see more, hit the subscribe button as well as the bell icon to get notified when I post. Sharing the video would be appreciated as well. I have a few links in the description if you'd like to support me in any way, shape, or form. One is PayPal, one is Kofi, one is the Amazon wishlist that has a few items on it that would make creating videos for you all easier. And the last two sites, Redbubble and Fine Art America, are where I sell my photography. So I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.